Hi, my name is Ashley Miller. I'm here at the Health 2.0 conference and I have a special guest. Can you please introduce yourself and tell us a bit about your organization? Okay, yes. Um, well, thank you and thanks for having me here. No problem. I'm Jeff Lucas and I'm the CEO and co-founder of Vital Eat Care. Uh, Vital Eat Care is a platform that we're developing right now that will provide a care coordination care collaboration platform for patients with chronic disease or high performance athletes, it doesn't matter, but those patients will be able to have all of their care team, whether it's primary care, all their specialists in managing their uh, problematic disease such as diabetes, heart disease, and also involve your family so that all of those members I just mentioned can have view into that patient and their needs, their health needs, they'll have their health records, they'll be able to use tools that will help them plan for their diet, their rest, their exercise, activity, lifestyle, making sure they're taking their medications and making sure they're seeing their specialists, which they would have to do if they are a diabetic patient. And Jeff, what inspired you to develop a program within your business like this? Well, it's actually been something that has been, uh, well, I've been thinking about this for decades, where I've had uh, 35 years of experience in healthcare dealing with large delivery organizations, clinical systems, electronic medical records, and it was always about providing a better environment in the clinic. But there was really no solution for when that patient leaves a clinic, and then they go home, and they've had a clinic visit, and the family says, so what did the doctor say? That's the first question you get. So you have to remember, but if we now have that information available immediately into that patient's electronic portal that family members have access, they can already understand what the doctor said before you get home. Now they can take action on the things the doctor said you need to be doing, right? So this was an inspiration that you know, I've, I've thought about for deeply a long time. I've had family health issues where a parent that uh, died early because of heart disease, a mother who went through um, ALS and the family that had to grapple with that. Um, that's a terminal disease. Uh, so it, it, it really inspired me through that personal experience and through my knowledge of healthcare and friends and families that have had situations where you have a diseased family member that really takes down the family because you have to step up and help that, that patient. Now, if we can do that seamlessly electronically, everybody can live a better life knowing that we're taking care of the patient, right? And I believe this is the future of care. I love that. And with that being said, also thank you and congratulations on being honored. How do you feel within being recognized with the success and the achievements that you've done moving forward within your business? And what has your experience here at the Health 2.0 conference been like? Well, you know, I think, you know, uh, an award like this, which I'm very thankful for, um, hard fought. You know, it's it's been a lot of, you know, failures on the way, successes as well, but meeting a lot of great people along the way. What I think is really great about what we're doing is the team that I've been able to recruit to be part of this in almost every instance. Each one of those members is smarter than me. So we have a lot of very smart people looking at this problem. That's gratifying to know that you've thought about something, you pushed it along far, than, far enough to get inspiration from the other team members to be part of it. And so that's, you know, we as a team, and I always say it's our company, it's our vision, because it is, because now they're putting their fingerprints all over this. Yes. Right. And with that being said, Jeff, where can the audience and online viewers connect with you online and your presence and your team? Well, the, I mean, obviously they can go to vitallycare.com, V-I-T-A-L-E-C-A-R.com. And also they can email me, which is simple, Jeffrey at vitallycare.com. And we're actually inviting people to come and seek us out um, because we like to share what we're doing for feedback because that is gonna, I think, develop sort of a socialization of this 
what we're bringing to market to get the feedback because it will now be the collaborative, the patient, the family, the care teams we, we, we get involved with that are going to help shape this further. That makes sense. That's amazing. It definitely does. And thank you so much for allowing me to interview you. And congratulations once again. Yeah, and you asked a question about the Health 2.0 conference. Yes. And I, I got to say, and I've been to many health conferences. Hims have been there many times. It's it's pretty impersonal. This is very personal. The the amount of people here, the quality of people here, the level of commitment of the people here in healthcare has been inspiring. So I, I, I said while I was uh, on a panel that we're, we're here, we're learning by listening. So I've listened to all of these people and I'm gonna walk away a lot smarter because I've heard from some people that are doing some great things. And likewise, you as well. And with Thank that you. being said, I definitely wanna close out with that because not only have we been very inspired by the words and things that you said, but also for others looking for guidance or that may not necessarily know where to begin, you had to begin somewhere and look at everything you've been able to achieve so far. Yes, yes. All right. Well, well thank you for the interview. No I appreciate problem. your time. It's been a pleasure. Thank you.